5 almost right now turning to our Huskies and the road to an NCAA basketball championship. You could say it's a road paved with excitement. Right. Our UConn men are just a day away from taking on the Miami Hurricanes. Let's check in with Channel 3's Mark Robbins who's in Texas this morning. He's live in Houston with more. Uh, Mark, how are the Huskies doing? Well, you know, this team, I'll tell you what, Wendell and uh, everybody back there, you know it. They're red hot. Very, very hot. Of course, you know, every team that gets to the Final Four is hot. It's on a winning streak. But UConn has been rolling, blowing out four teams to get to this point at the Final Four. They've won four big games by uh, double digits and more than 20 points. One of the big reasons that UConn is on such a big roll is its big man. Adama Sanogo, the All Big East performer, also an All West Region tournament performer as UConn went on its rampage through Albany and Las Vegas. Sanogo has been a force at both ends of the floor, scoring, defending, also making his teammates better. And that's appreciated by another talented big man, Bristol Central freshman Donovan Klingon. Adama has made me a much better player throughout the whole year. Um, he's so talented on both ends of the floor. Uh, his footwork is, you know, amazing. So trying to, you know, defend him and keep, you know, stay on my feet and stay physical, you know, it's always it's been a challenge for me all year. But you know, he's okay. he prepared me for the, you know, Big East play, and you know, he prepared me for the highest level like like that we're in now. And when you talk about Donovan Klingon and Dama Sanogo, two big reasons the Huskies are here and two big reasons if they're going to, well, they'll win the national championship in part because of those two guys. Of course, the national semifinal Saturday only on Channel 3, 849-ish for the tip of the Huskies and Miami here in Houston. We'll have more coming up later on in our newscast. Reporting live in Houston at the Final Four, Mark Robbins, Channel 3, Eyewitness Sports.